Welcome to Quasar Science. I am Ben Dynas, CTO, and today I'm here to talk to you about the new update that we have for the RR and R2 lights called 0.5G. Up first, we have the light output mode now is able to be controlled from the DMX channel. Previously, we had profiles 1 through 15 that are your standard and effects profiles, and now we have profiles 31 through 45, where the last channel of that profile is now the output channel. From 0 to 30 is high output mode, from 31 to 60 is standard mode, and from 61 to 100 is low output mode. Up next, we made a few enhancements to our built-in manual effects. First up is our fire effect. We now have a few presets in the light so you could quickly change between color temperatures to achieve the fire effect you're looking for. Secondly, we ha now have color enhancements to the emergency lights so you could jump between color presets, red and blue, blue and green, blue and white, so on and so forth. Next, we have automatic Bluetooth naming. This is for when you're connected to the light from an app, it will automatically assign a unique name to the light. Lastly, we have some UI enhancements and some bug fixes. Check out the release notes at quasarscience.com support where you could download the latest 5G version now. Thanks for listening. Up next, we have now, he, 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 he. Yeah, more of that. No, damn. <laughs> So first up, we have emergency light mode. We now have color presets and there are people talking in my shot. Annabelle. We do need to institute a bell. I do have approval of this, by the way. You can't, it's, I'm fine with it being funny. You can't cut, you can't cut the legitimacy discrediting me. You kill it, okay.